All right. Thanks so much, Andrew. Well, Charlie here from the Glassport Zoo. <laughs> he, he's alive. He, he brought with him <laughs> this ferret who has pretty much taken over the desk. I know he was, uh, while you were gone, he was under the desk. He was smelling everything. He wanted and to see what your scripts were. And now he's just relaxing, yeah. having a good time. He wanted to go over to the weather, but, you know. Andrew said, he, Andrew none said, of no, that. He's busy. <laughs> Later, later. Or later. Okay, well, tell us all about Chip. Well, he's uh, one of, uh, part of our collection of our animal ambassadors there at the ed education department. And um, Chip's one of our uh, two ferrets that we have there. Um, and we have, actually have um, them in two different areas. We have them in Small World, so if you want to see them on exhibit, they'll be there. In the education department, they're not on exhibit. But um, we do have them, of course, when we take out to schools or special events, and kids love kids them. Kids love them. Because they're so um, adorable, and they're, they're funny looking. And, and they're, they're so flexible. They're, they're so flexible, yeah. Pretty much you can just move them around. And that's pretty much what's <laughs> fancy. You know, they're, they're a descendant of the European polecat. Mm -hmm. They don't exist in the wild. They're a domesticated ferret. Mm -hmm. But um, um, we um, supply them, like, different little activities, and they're right. actually so flexible they can completely turn around in a very confined space. And, really? like, a tube or something, and they can just go completely backwards and their their spine is so flexible their whole body is so flexible that they can just um get they can get into and get out of anything, anything. yeah definitely yeah. i'm looking at these sharp claws right here <laughs> yeah they do and and they, you know believe it or not you know they're they they are they're predators so they they hunt down their food of course at the zoo they eat a specialized diet but um uh, weasels or uh, your purple cats and they, they're in their natural environment they're very aggressive really? uh hunters and okay. it's because they're you give them the thing; they're fearless. That's what the thing. They're they're fearless, and they'll go after anything. So of course, that that um, that aggression sometimes will scare off um, animals that are bigger than them. And even at the zoo, they they don't care. They don't they don't care who you are. They don't care what's there. <laughs> they're gonna go to exactly where they want to go. All right. Well, he seems so cute. It doesn't seem like he'd be he is, aggressive yeah. at all. No, he's not. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, I know you guys are very busy. This is. Busy time for Busy you. Busy time. Getting ready for the summer, Memorial Day. Every single end day. Of school. Yeah, every single day we have tons of kids coming to the zoo, so it's really good. And of course, the parents um, uh, come out and, and follow the kids. Just my nephew was here at the zoo today, and my, my brother and sister. And um, so it's a good thing. It's good, like you know that you can still join the, the the kids on their field trip, and and it's a good. The, the school likes it. You get to be with your kids and kind of experience that. But of course, we have um, uh, a lot of. Going up, things going on. We're going to open up a new exhibit, a new monkey exhibit in the beginning of June. Cool. Um, I know it's going to be really, it's beautiful exhibit, so you need to go check that out. And just wait, look for your summer pass because the summer passes that we're sending out to the elementaries, um, they're um, a really great deal. It's up to four kids with those summer passes can get in with one paid adult. Nice. And um, so, of course, it's our mission to bring the zoo to everybody, mm -hmm. and those passes went to schools all over the valley. And of course, if you're a zoo member, um, you could always purchase a membership for $80. Zoo member, you get in free. We have um, Yapopalooza coming up June 10th, and then we have uh, our turtle project starting to be going on. So there's a lot of stuff. Check out our Facebook, and we have a lot of information about that. All right, sounds good. Well, thanks so much for joining Thank us. You. And we are going to be right back.